welcome you're watching another video of the giri cost it's match day again so we're off to malaga where malaga will play today against real murcia last time we played them was at the start of the season they were shit they were shit they were nowhere malaga won 4-1 i think not so much because malaga played so well in that match but because real murcia was horrible but everything has changed on the table everything has changed for real murcia they are now close to getting a play a playoff ticket so they're coming with a lot of energy a dangerous team at the moment so we'll see what happens vamos to malaga Madrid. A quick beer before we go in. It starts to rain a bit, so I hope that it doesn't rain a lot because I didn't bring a jacket. But looking forward to the match. Kick off at 12. I think soon we're going to the stadium. It seems that Murcia brought a lot of away fans. We will see it in the stadium. But vamos Malaga. So we're on our way to La Rosaleta. I'm looking forward to it. Vamos Malaga. I just found some shade because it's getting warm. I don't have a t-shirt, I don't have a sweater. My Gimme Plus sweater. Um, so yeah, a bit of a boring match. I was asking myself, like, if we go to playoffs, what chance do we stand in playoffs? And I said it on the preview podcast last week, that if you have to go into playoffs like this, you're not making it even to the we don't make it even to the second round of the players. So I hope Malaga will find a, their form back again because um, over the past few weeks Malaga's been looking shit. 
two draws last week. We won against Atletico Madrid, but it looked horrible. So I can only hope Malaga finds back his form and wins today. Because we need a good second half and we need goals. That's one thing we need. We need to gain the confidence back. Vamos Malaga. Same start as the whole first half. But as you can see, the fans are behind the team. So Vamos Malaga. Let's get that three points today. The sun is shining. Malaga should have a penalty. It was cl more clear impossible. Crazy. Besides, a Malaga player got a red card. Horrible, horrible ref. I don't know. If this is going to be the rest of the season, I'm done. Because this is every week the same thing when we play it over. Horrible referees. And I'm not saying they against Malaga. But at this level, I mean, come on, you have to be... They're just not good enough. Well... for this week, Malaga draw 0-0 in La Rosaleda. We should have had a penalty. I didn't see the red card, so I cannot say anything about it. But the penalty was very, very clear. Still, I think we didn't draw because of the penalty. Uh, I think we're not good enough. I think we're not good enough and I don't know. We changed a bit when Ramon came onto the pitch. He's the only player who looks forward instead of backwards. It's not good enough. It's no excuse. Ref was horrible. I think the worst ref seen this season in La Rosaleda. A bad, bad performance for the ref. And now it's starting to get boring. Every week, the same thing with the refs, with the other teams not trying to play football that from start to finish, time wasting. I'm happy for the Real Murcia fans that they celebrated the, the red card and the, and the no penalty. I don't know what to say. Celebrating those things seem a bit off to me, but I'm no one to judge that. The only thing I can say is Malaga draw, not looking good for playoffs. So next week, Cordoba, I hope we can get tickets. I hope we can go and so I can do a video from there. This is what it is for this week. Don't forget to like, subscribe, press the like button, subscribe on our channel. 
We are the Giri Coast. My name is Chris Marquez and vamos Malaga always.